to satisfy her son's unusual desires. A scientist mother repeatedly cloned a girlfriend for him. Her son, Spencer, had severe violent tendencies and would assault his girlfriend at the slightest provocation. When the girlfriend finally broke up with him, an enraged Spencer killed her. His doting mother not only helped him dispose of the body, but also began creating clone after clone for him. These clones were identical to the girlfriend, but lacked memories. Each time Spencer spent less than 10 minutes with a clone, he would strangle her and repeatedly bash her head on the floor. Countless clones met their demise this way, until one clone miraculously survived and discovered them as a relationship between the mother and son. She sneaked into the laboratory, found the experiment records, and uncovered the truth. The clone decided to put an end to it all. She ran out of the house and hid. When Spencer came out searching for someone, the clone ambushed him from behind, knocked him down, and strangled him, just as he had done to every other clone. Spencer met his end at the hands of the clone. But the tragedy did not end there. The scientist's mother, unable to accept her son's passing, used cloning technology to recreate Spencer. Whether she would be delighted that her son no longer exhibited violent tendencies or driven mad by the fact that he wasn't her true son is unknown. What is certain, however, is that this marks the beginning of yet another tragedy.